couple of weeks ago, my son asked me, we were in the car driving, my wife was there, and he said, Dad, what superhero would you want to be, or what superhero strength would you want? Now, he assumed he knew the answer, because Hulk is my favorite character. And he assumed I was going to say superhuman strength, or I wanted to be the Hulk. Because, frankly, who doesn't like to smash? Anyway, without hesitation, I said influence. And at that moment, my wife, who was sitting in the back seat, yelled out, Oh, dear God, no. Now, I must concede my wife is correct, because influence without wisdom is a weapon of mass destruction. It will be used all for the wrong purposes and cause a lot of damage. And actually, if you're like me, you probably were using your influence wrong, or you're using your influence wrong. I was using it for many, many, many years of my life to consume on me. I assumed my influence was mine. It was my gift to me. And I was using it to get promoted, to make more money, to buy bigger and better things, to have a bigger home, to stand out, to build my brand, to get ahead. All of those things and anything to do to help me and my family. So it was really restricted. It was like living on an island. Until a friend called me out. It's about 10 years ago. And he said, Ed, you're consuming your influence on yourself. He said, because you think you've manufactured it. He said, no, it was a gift to you. And it was to given to you to be used for others, to influence others. And he says, and as you do that, all of that stuff that you're trying to get, the promotion to stand out, the brand to get more, he says, all that will come to you. But you're using influence backwards. You're using it on yourself. You're consuming it like a drug addict for you when it was meant for others. So here's what I want you to do today. I want you to do what my friend told me. Pick one person today. One person that's around you. I don't care who it is, but today I want you to influence them. An influence is something that can be very, very small. Help them to smile, to laugh, feel better about themselves, help to inspire or motivate them. Be there for them. Influence somebody beside yourself today. Take your focus off you and influence somebody else because influence is a superhero type of strength. And it must be used for others if you're going to use it correctly. Because one day, as you start to influencing, as you grow every day influencing just one person, you're going to graduate. You're going to start influencing a business, a community, a neighborhood, a church. You're going to influence people on a mass scale, and that's where you should be at. So today I want you to pick one person, just one, and influence them today to feel better about themselves. Help them today to motivate and to inspire. My name is Ed Carcary, and I'd love to connect with you at edcarcary.com. Find your passion. You'll find your life.